Face off to the far side of the Storm's offensive zone. Critchlow wins it cleanly back. Morrow spins and sends it across. Phillips trying to sweep through. Took a crazy bounce and is in the back of the net. 1 0 for the Manchester Storm. Goal on the power play from the side of the goal. Stephen Johnson. His intention was probably to sweep it all the way across to Joe Morrow, who takes a crazy bounce. We'll have a look on the replay. Phillips has this puck, sends it down low. Trying to sweep it through. And the calm player trying to block the lane. And inadvertently blocks it and bounces it straight into his own net. Craighead, top of the circles, fades away to the boards. Hounded and hassled. Rimmed around the boards, far side point. Crowell's put pressure on. Johnson to keep the pressure going and tipped in front. It's Hayden with the final touch. And the shot from the point. Ties the game up with 1.17 left to play on the power play. The Glasgow clan tie the game. Storm kind of caught running around in the defensive zone. And Johnson goes out to the point. He even finds that soft area in front of the net. Gets a stick on it, tips it high past Weddinger to tie the game at one. Garcia to pick it up. Storm collects on the balls, chip up and chase. Sent across, one more pass and Hyden finds a way! It's in the back of the goal. It's that top line doing it again between Tremblay, Critchlow and Heinem with the final touch. Tremblay to Critchlow, backhand across. Didn't think he was going to make it through to the number nine, but Swat said it. And does enough to poke it past the goaltender. Over the pad, under the glove. And from seemingly nothing, the Storm are back in front 2-1 to one, with exactly 17 minutes to play in the second period. Good poke check. We'll send the Storm back the other way. And we'll lift the crowd as well. Johnson into the slot. Phillips shot. It's underneath. It's loose. Crisloe finds it and puts it in the back of the net. It's number three. Captain Critchlow, journey on the spot, in the right place at the right time. He's look at a great angle from behind the goal, puck goes across, shot goes off the pad, thought he thought he had hold of it. And Critchlow just sweeps it into the open net, won't get an easier goal than that one. 15.02 to play, 3-1 the score. Just over skated the puck. Bobbles had in front and that might have to be alert to put that one away from danger. Stepping down from the point and getting absolutely rocked by Sol. Storm player still down, Critchlow trying to send it in front, it's in the back of the net. As Murphy took a hit to make a play. Be gentle with the handshakes boys. As Murphy looks shaken up from that hit. It's 4 1, it's in the back of the net. And good play between Critchlow and Heinem. Extends the lead to three. If you'll watch the whole play again. Sol steps into Murphy. Keep an eye on him. The play goes on behind the back of the goal. Critchlow pulls it out. In front, it goes right across the face of goal. And although he had two guys draped all over him in Seoul and Reese Kelly. Tyler Hynum did enough to get the stick on the puck and turn it behind the clan netminder for goal number four for the Storm. 
Can read that and take it back up the other end. Craighead turning. Sends into the slot. Keeley can't get the shot away. And Erdhardt steps up from defence. Going in all alone. The big man in on goal. Still loose. And it's in the back of the net. Dallas Erhardt for number five on the night. For the Manchester Storm. The D-man stepping up into the play. Muscles his way to the front of the net. Stuck around long enough. To pull that puck off the pads. And send it backhand in on goal. We'll get a great view from behind the back of the net. This puck bounces back in. And Erdhart does just enough. To poke it past the outstretched pad of Carolina in net. Loose put goes back D to D. Fence passing as they come up the ice. Over the blue line, chips in, continues on his skate, goes falling down on a very light touch and no penalty called from the middle of the ice. Bolton finds a way. It may have been touched in front, we'll check on the replay. It's Hayden. He's going to be taking the handshake lines in front of the benches. And you've got to feel that the clan were deserving on that one after having a goal called back. The backhand shot from Bolton with Hayden parked out in front. Got tipped out of the air. And behind Weddinger, it's 5 2. To the Manchester Storm. Clam in the ensuing draw, go D to D and up the boards. Turn over to the Storm, Erdhart. Murphy just tried to do a bit too much in the neutral zone. Puck ramped up and into Erdhart's face. Backhand in front, a broken play in front. And Clan strike twice in a matter of seconds. It looks like Lynch is taking the handshakes this time around. Morrow's backhand ends up. This was the Hayden goal. That's what made it 5 2. And Bolton steps in from the point on the backhand, and Hayden just comes out of nowhere and tips that one down. Not much Wellinger could do about that one. And this is goal number three. Just picks it up in that loose area, just inside the, the hash marks. Meanwhile, in the rink, timeout is called. Johnson has that puck poked away by Alakovic. And Lynch goes short side. And on the backhand, eludes Wellinger's glove. Both teams use their timeout now. Well read from Moore, and he steps up in the play, along with Martin. Over the blue line, shot, pad save, rebound. Pulls straight to a clan stick. Turnover on the half wall. That one sticks into the corner as well. Martin has Phillips out in front. Pass to the back door. Zach Phillips on the 77. Restores a three goal lead for the Manchester Storm. Great patience and awareness. With a broken play. And Martin sucks in all of the attention on himself. And lays it off to number 77, Zach Phillips. He gets himself on the scoreboard. And gets the storm. Up 6-3 over the Glasgow clan. Erdhart. One-time shot from Morrow. Blocked. Broken stick on the play. Storm. Still with possession. Ten seconds left to go. Over to Morrow. Holds, holds, finds Phillips, shot! And that's the final nail in the coffin. A one-time snipe from number 77. Up high. Makes it 7-3 on the night. Power play goal, Zach Phillips. <laughs>